Peace, everyone. If you're new to my channel, welcome. I'm Nubian. And for those of you who are returning, what's up, y'all? Welcome to another beautiful, masterful moment in time, y'all. Look, I got a quick message for you chosen ones out there, for you remnant. For those of you who have set up specific campsites or know of people who are linking the remnant together right now while it is still light outside, this is a time for um, the remnant to link together. So shoot your email um, to me. Make sure that I get it. Also, be very mindful that a prophetic word has come through regarding your campsites. So a lot of people are going to be fleeing to your campsites, okay? So the Bible says that you shall know them by their fruit. Don't forget that you shall know them by their fruit. But be very mindful that there are a lot of wolves and sheep clothing out there. And there shall be wolves that shall sneak into your campsites. But also be mindful that just as sure as Yeshua had Judas, there will be Judas amongst you as well. So always be very mindful, be very watchful. But at the same time, too, God says that even though they sneak amongst you in your campsites, Every single individual within that campsite will have to inhabit their own personal connection, their own personal relationship with God Almighty in order to have the shield and the protective codes and the seal to be protected from the coming plagues and diseases and things that are getting ready to hit the land, even natural disasters. So I'm seeing a vision even now of... Moses acts or acts as such that are going to transpire at some point in time so there will be a gathering of God's people and then from there when God gathers his people there will be that second exodus as spoken of within the Bible um and that is when you see the abomination of proclamation spoken of by abomination of desolation spoken of by Daniel the prophet standing in the holy place so make sure that you guys understand what it is that I'm saying. Yes, Spirit. Thank you, Spirit, for bringing that to my remembrance. I'm, 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 I praise you. I, I thank you. I, I honor you. I thank you so much for your, for your anointing. I thank you so much for, for using me and for allowing me to speak your word. I'm humble. Okay, so... You shall know them by their fruit. God's people are sealed, but there will be some that will sneak in your camp as spies. And when they sneak in your camp as spies, make sure that you keep proper documentation of who's who, who's there, who's passing through. And most importantly, make sure that everyone is bartering and exchange to build towards the kingdom of what it is that God has put it in your hand to oversee and keep in mind that you're the overseer so allow no one to abuse their position there at all or you take dominance you take jurisdiction and you have full authority to eject them from your camps be watchful in this hour for Satan is running around trying to seek whom he may devour. He's using food, y'all. And even in God's people, he's using food. And that food is to prevent you from fasting. Prevent you from seeking God. Prevent you from stepping into your calling. Prevent you from stepping into your true anointing. And in the coming days ahead, a lot of God's people are going to take the mark of the beast. And he's going to use food. I'm seeing a good third of the population will fall for that one alone, which is deep. Wow. One sixth I'm seeing as well. God wants his people to continue to praise him. There is a passage that is written. In the Bible that talks about people will be coming from afar 
because they will hear God's people singing praises to him in the mountains. And they will say, let us go up on the mountains and see what it is that God's people is saying about what is happening next in this hour. It's deep. Because we don't walk in fear. This is the hour where so many people are, are going to realize that there's a lot of beings that are walking amongst us. But if you don't know who you are, you don't know what your powers are. Wow. Wow. I'm humble to be of service to you because I'm here about my father's business. Nubian Divine.